Hey, y'all, y'all tuned in right now to that Hood Talk News, man. That's your boy, Big Panamera, JT Bigger Figure in Lockstone, Blackstone. You dig all the way from Fillmore, Africa, man. Keep pushing, my G. Man, you already know what it is. All money in, no money out. Jay Stone from the east to the west. You already know, man. Shout out to Hood Talk News. You already know. Yo, yo, yo. What's good? What's good? Man, we got a lot to talk about today, man. We got a lot, a lot going on out here in the world. We got goddamn Tamar. We got Will. And I want to get into a little bit of what Slim Thug was talking about. But I'm going to start off with goddamn Tamar and goddamn um, Krishan. All right? So now we got Tamar and Krishan. Now, Tamar, I guess, invited Krishan to a show. You know what I'm saying? And uh, when it was time for Krishan to go on, they skipped her. They said they couldn't find her, and they skipped her, right? So they get back in the dressing room, and Krishan look at the guy that said they can't find her. You know what I'm saying? The guy James or whoever, Tamar's sister, whatever, background, saint, whatever the hell he is, all right? He said he couldn't find her, right? So they say Krishan done latched on him. Now she done boom, boom, boom. Y'all know how Krishan do. She jumped on him and, and whooped him. Now, God damn it. Hey, uh, now, I'm da- now, I know he ain't all the way right. You know what I'm saying? He's a funny bunny, but check this out. Now, God damn it. I'm, I'm tired of seeing these goddamn women goddamn whoop these men up. Now, what the fuck going on, man? What is going on? He, these women been whooping butt, boy. But listen, this is what I really want to say, man. Krishan, listen, man. You need to calm down. Because right now, what you're doing is burning bridges. You need to look at a lot of these old entertainers, old rappers, singers out here that's whining and crying now. Want to come back. Can't get back to what they had. You get what I'm saying? A lot of them messed it up. A lot of them went to jail for a lot of time and came back out and think they still going to be on top. But it's newcomers in the way now like you. You know what I'm saying? So I want you to take advantage of this opportunity, man. Because people looking at how you act. And all they're going to do is blackball you. They're going to throw you out. Just look around now. I want you to look around. You think a lot of these entertainers on social media crying and whining for nothing? The only reason they coming on whining and crying because they done messed their career up. They know they blew their chance. They know it ain't going to be another chance for them. So the only attention they can get is coming and whining and crying on social media to everybody. You don't want to end up like one of them living in regrets. That's the worst thing you can live in is regrets. Get your money, take care of your family, because, listen, it's a saying in the music industry. We can make a new you. We can find a new you now. Any, they can make anybody a star. You know what I'm saying? So you got to look around, man, and, and see what's going on around you and, and know how to handle this, man. Because if you don't, you're going right back to the hood. I'm telling you, man. They will throw, they will, man, listen, they will chew you up and spit you out in Hollywood. So, you know, when you got people, and then, then you talking about fighting Tamar, right? You got to understand, Tamar ain't come from, she's not the part of the Ratchet clan. She's not going to fight you. She's going to call the cops on you. She's going to press charges on you. Keep the street stuff in the streets. When you handle their business, keep it business. You can't want to fight people in this business. They will put charges on you, man. And you'll be up under the prison, sitting in prison saying, Dang, I gave away my good life for this. You see what I'm saying? Better pull it together, man. Somebody needs, that's what I said, man. Like OGs need to step up. And when I say OGs, I'm talking about OG women too. You know what I'm saying? Somebody need to be in her ear. You know, and I know a lot of these kids you can't really talk to. They're going to do their own thing because I know I was once there before. But somebody need to step in and, and, and beg her. Plead with her. Let her know that, man, listen, it's going to turn out ugly, man. You're going to be right back in the in, in the hood with nothing. With nothing, man. But that's all I want to say on that, man. Now, let's get into this Will. This stuff Tasha K putting out. Now, it's Tasha K got supposed to be Will Smith assistant. Saying that, you know, he walked in the door and, and, and Dwayne Martin was beating the brakes off Will. I'm talking about this. He said he was beating the brakes off of him, right? My thing is, like, why now, man? I, it's like, every why why all these assistants and all these people, right, they come out after it's over? 
After the benefits done ran out, after everything said and done, they ain't got no money. They ain't got nothing going on. They want to come out with a goddamn story, man. The story will sound more better if you in this, right? Check this out. This is this, this how I will believe a lot of these people, right? Now, not saying this is not true, but this is how I know you real. When it's going on, right? Because you see, when, when y'all come out talking, that just show me you compromise everything you supposed to stand for. For this shit here, right? So what I'm saying is, if you was to come out when this shit happened, like, oh, no, I can't be around with them no more. No, man, that shit go get everything I stand for. No way, no how, no chance. It's over with. I'm not your assistant no more. No, you waited until the benefits wore out. And then you want to come tell your story. That's the, that's what make it hard. Why nobody, why nobody, if, if you're so real, why nobody tell the story in the moment? Like, it, man, look. This nigga did some stuff that go against everything I stand for. I'm telling it now. I don't want nothing to do with this, man. But they ain't because they sitting over there enjoying the benefit. And then you don't know when to believe them because you still a, a mad, bitter, and angry person. And we've been knowing Tasha K, man. Tasha K, you getting sued by lies. So, you know, I, I don't know how many people want to run with this story. If it's true or not, God damn it, it it's like edgy. Because, you know what I'm saying, a lot of these people make up a lot of stuff to get their rocks off. Motherfucker, then next week they coming out with a book. Then the next week they coming out with a goddamn podcast. You see what I'm saying? That's how they do it, man. They tr he, That person trying to come up, man. When the bit Listen, y'all. When the benefits wear out, that's the only time you see these niggas trying to come and tell it all and tell this and tell that. Nigga, if you so real... And this story is so real. You should have told it when it was going on, man. That'd make a motherfucker believe you when that shit going on. You said, fuck them benefits. Forget everything that, that come with this here. God damn it. I'm finna tell it now because it go against my character. No, none of y'all ain't gonna do that. None of y'all ain't gonna do that. Y'all enjoying the goddamn benefits. Y'all enjoying the goddamn benefits, man. So check this out. I believe a story, right? Not saying this dude lying, but I believe a real story when a person jump out the goddamn, like how, how uh, your boy did on Boys in the Hood. He got out the car right there. Nope, I can't do that. He ain't wait the afterwards to go to tell. He told them straight up, let me out, though. I can't do it. No, God, I might be the nigga to tell. You know what I'm saying? Let me out right now, though. I might be the nigga to tell. Let me out. God damn it. That's how a real motherfucker do it. God damn it. Now, moving right a goddamn long. Slim Thug, yeah, goddamn Slim. Slim. Slim is, is Slim is fighting with some demons, man. Slim, I, what you said, Slim, you need to get on your knees and pray that God forgive you. Because just because you feel it was right sleeping with these married women and all that, man, you were wronger than the mud, man. You and them was wrong, goddamn it. But, you know, they, it, you just teaching the guys that married them, man, you better know what the hell you marrying, God damn it. Because if any married woman would let a rapper that they know sleep with all type of women, you know what I'm saying? If he'll sleep with you the same night, you know he's that type of rapper that'll sleep with any woman. This nigga talking about he done slept with so many. Then he talking about how they don't use condoms and stuff like that. And he know what married women don't use, you know, condoms and all. Come on, man. What the hell? Man, what is this world coming to, man? It's like anything for the clout. If you doing that, who business it is? You know what I'm saying? I know ain't no more married women finna sleep with you, bro. I don't, I, God damn. I ain't never know your career with that goddamn big where married women dropping they drop. But hey, you know, like Shot G said, man, when they came to the Tupac rape case, he was like, man, you know, anybody with mild celebrity status can... You know what I'm saying? Ain't no way in hell Tupac raped anybody with my anybody with my celebrity status could get any chick they want. God damn it! Yeah, you know, and I ain't gonna say any chick they want, but I know being a rapper, right? You got a bunch of groupies to choose from. I mean, they all over you. I don't give a damn if your face would just show in the video. God damn it, they all over you. That's how the, that's how the music world was. I know when I was out there. You know what I'm saying? So. This, 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 what Slim talking about, man. I mean, that shit go against everything I stand for. You know what I'm saying? Cause I remember back in the days, niggas used to be like, oh, nah, she got a ring on her finger. Leave her alone. Not these days. These niggas don't care, boy. 
But Slim, they talk about the cough in the video, man. They talking about the cough, man. You better go get goddamn checked out. But I know you were hitting the joint, goddamn it. Everybody didn't see it. They talk about that cough. Man, y'all got to pay attention. He was, hitting the, he was hitting the weed, goddamn it. He was hitting the weed. That's why he was coughing. But goddamn, I don't know, goddamn it. Slim, you, Slim. Goddamn it, you better go get it checked out, goddamn it. Because you, you don't know. It. Just because they married, they slept with your ass. They ain't no telling who else they was sleeping with. See, a lot of these niggas be feeling like, goddamn it, oh, I'm the celebrity, so they slept with me. Shit. She could, it, it, that could be true because I done seen women that married, right? Never did this before. At least they say they ain't never did it before. But still, you got to watch out from that too, Slim. Because she, just like she slept with you, I ain't no telling how many other celebrities, rappers, or anybody that she slept with. You probably wasn't the first. You feeling special like that, but you probably wasn't the first until you go get that test. And then they be like, uh, uh. And he be like, oh. Uh, the last part of that was the married girl. See what I'm saying? God damn it, because, hey, listen, that's a dangerous thing. When you could get one that married, you got to wonder who else got her. You married and sleeping with me. Who else done had you? I know I ain't the first goddamn motherfucker you done ran across that you wanted to sleep with. Come on, man. You got to be more smarter than this, Slim. They talking about they married. Half of them probably won't even marry. They probably just saying that to make it look good for you. For you will want them more than you want the rest of the female. Oh, because you know that 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 probably lives certain niggas. You know, confident. Oh shit, boy, she married. Boy, I'm doing it, boy. I'm doing it, boy. They love me, boy. Hey, boy, they'm doing. It. No, they could be lying just to be the chosen one out the out the bunch. Oh boy, I'm going with the married one. I know ain't nobody been telling that she married. Yeah, right. Bro, don't buy all that, man. But shout out to all the good women out there, man, that respect they, they household, respect their husband, that ain't going to do nothing like that. I know a lot of men will say, oh, man, all women are light. And I know a lot of women that say, all oh, men are dogs and all of them are light. But, man, trust me, there's some good ones out there. Because the things that this nigga talk about he doing, I didn't never do, God damn it. We had respect, God damn it, for married women, God damn it. When I was single out there, we had respect. Oh, she got a ring on her. Any, any dude in the 90s, no, that's how we was. Oh, she got a ring on her feet. We had respect, man. Ain't no respect in this world no more, god damn it. The ring supposed to show you that, hey, I'm going to respect that. God damn it, she's married. I'm not even finna try to talk to her. That's what the ring supposed to be, god damn it. Now the ring don't mean shit. That means, god damn it, hey, boy, she married. Oh, boy, I know she ain't going to tell nothing because she married. Let me get her. And they go for it. Some of them. Not all of them. It's still some good women out there. See, we see that's what they're trying to do. They're trying to overflood us with the bad stuff in the world. Like everything we do is goddamn bad. But it's still some good between all that shit. You only see a few in your face. You gotta goddamn dig deep, goddamn. You got you ain't even gotta dig deep. Get your ass off. Get 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 off the internet, goddamn it. Turn turn your face away from your goddamn phone and you'll see all the real shit in the world. Ain't no mystery. It's just the, the picture they paint into y'all, man. That's it, man. This it, it ain't really like that in the world. When you turn off your turn away from your phone and turn get off the internet, your real life ain't like the internet. Still the same struggle. Still the same bills need to be paid. Still the same everything. Sometimes y'all will get caught up and forget to pay your bill because you're caught up in this fantasy world. On the internet. You doing everything to please the internet. Buying Gucci and all it to take pictures and all this stuff here. Photo shoots. To please the internet. And some of y'all will forget about, hey, I still got a real life with real bills. And kids. Some of y'all. So, hey, man, we got to wake up, man. Hey, man, I just came to bring y'all that. Like, share, and subscribe to the realest platform on the planet. Good Talk New. I'm out. Young Nap, baby. But I know. I just wanna take the time to really get to know ya. Got so many thoughts in my head, I wanna show ya. I don't really know ya, I just wanna hold ya. Is it cause of him? Why you acting bipolar? Last time I see me and you had a conversation, even had a smile when I told you that I'm gon' take you, baby girl. He don't make you got your heart, don't let him break you. Shawty be a 20 out of 10, ain't no need to rate you, baby girl. So fly, brought tears to my eyes. Every time I hear your story, how he put you down, let me turn that frown around. I promise I stay down. I fly you to my Miami and take you away from this clown We can spend some time So drop that ego I see you come meet some different people Cause girl I know how to treat you Promise I won't deceive you I told my mama about you And now she wanna meet you Girl you one of them ones So let a nigga treat you Baby I 
Something I want, I go and get it I don't think they get it, you gotta make them feel it Baby girl, they nothing like me, I stand on business Coming right out with a boss and we can get it Ain't no no small time shit, cause I'm the biggest Leave them in his feelings, I'm so like we chillin' Take you to the top and watch this sight from my building I said I'm rich, I'm building, I'm tryna get some millions Keep that 4 five cock, but I ain't looking for no killings Baby girl, I'm serious, how you think I'm dealing? I can see it in your eyes, you tired, you need some healing You feeling? Maybe I don't know you, but it shows, and you know you're so beautiful, baby. I don't know you, but I know, but I know, and it shows you're such a beautiful soul. So be-